Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to make a VNC connection to a virtual machine running Linux in VMware Workstation. So if you don't want to have to figure out uh, the network connections, you know, using the host network or bridge and try and figure out all that just to get them on the same network, you could use the VNC connection that's built into VMware Workstation itself to do so. So we have a Ubuntu uh, Linux VM and also a Debian VM here, so we're going to connect to both of them. And then I also download the free VNC viewer by Real VNC. And that's what we're going to use as our client. So to do so, you just need to go to the settings for the VM. Go to the options tab. Look for VNC connections. By default, it's disabled. So you just need to check the box. You could use the default port of 5900 if you want. Uh, you could put a password if you want as well. Let's just do the password on this one here. And click OK. So now, when you set up your VNC connection, you need to use the IP address of your host running a VMware Workstation. So in my case, it's 192.168.1.141. So we're going to go here, do a new connection. Let's call this one Ubuntu. You can put a label if you want. Uh, you could set the encryption level. Or I just leave it on let VNC server choose. And you could have the update desktop preview automatically, which is this right here. Click OK. So now we'll just right click it, connect. And it says will not be encrypted. Click OK, continue. You could check the box not to warn you again if you want. Now since when this one has a password, let's put in the password I just entered in VMware Workstation. You can remember the password if you want. So now here's our, our desktop. So I'm recording this at a low resolution for this YouTube video, so it'll actually look better than this if you try it yourself. All right, so that's uh, Ubuntu. So now let's go back and do the Debian. Same process here. Uh, there we go. We'll leave no password. We're going to leave the same port number, and I'll show you what happens with that. So you get this error here address already already in use. That's because we're using the same port number. So if we were to try and go in here, make a new connection. See, it's trying to get to our other one here. which is already open because we're using the same port number. So even though I named it Debian, I didn't change the port number, so it's trying to connect to this Ubuntu because it's using 5900. So well, what we need to do is go back to the settings here. And change the port number. 5901 if you want, just make sure it's a port that you're obviously not using for something else. Okay, so now I'll go back to our viewer here. Let's edit this one here. Now we need to uh, add the port number. So colon 5901. So that way we're not using the default. If you don't put the uh, port number, it uses the default to 5901. So click OK. Connect. Continue. No password. So now here's our Debian desktop. Here's our Ubuntu. So now we could use them both at the same time because we're using a different port number for uh, Debian. So once again, from the VM, settings, options, VNC connections, check the box, put a password if you want for the connection. And if you're going to be using more than one VM uh, with VNC, uh, give each one a different port number, and then you should be good to go. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.